How you doing? Can you understand me through my weird accent? Is that all right? A woman told me today that I speak very good English. Yes. And I said, thank you. Because I do. Um, we have no idea how tonight's going to go, but we're very excited about it. Um, I wrote uh, the music and lyrics to Beetlejuice, and along the way... Who's, who's seen it? So along the way, a lot of songs died, and songs die for lots of reasons. Sometimes they're terrible songs, but we're not doing terrible songs for you tonight. We're doing, hopefully not terrible songs, we're doing songs that were like inappropriate or, um, or took up a lot of time or uh, didn't make enough sense or slowed the pace or were too weird. And we thought that since you guys are fans of the show, and you must be because you got, I don't know how you got in here. Uh, <laughs> very small venue and a, and a high demand, but we're going to do a whole bunch of songs that have never been heard before in public. Yeah. Right on. Uh, and then you can judge. You can judge for yourself as to why they got cut. Um, so we're very excited to do this, but I just want to point out a couple of things. One of them is, uh, this is going to be like a dirty downtown uh, version of uh, these songs. As you'll see, there are like stands here with music on it. These guys are doing eight shows a week and uh, have no lives and we've asked them to do a concert and learn a whole bunch of new songs and I write too many lyrics and uh, so they'll be keeping these on hand. I'm not doing it because I wrote the songs and I should know them so that's uh, the, the goal that I've thrown down for myself. So, we're ready to get into it? Uh, what better thing to do than to open with an alternate opening number? Uh, the whole being dead thing is actually not the uh, first choice, not even the third choice. I think it was like the fourth song uh, I wrote, and there are a lot of weird songs along the way, but the one that I really liked the most was a song called Gotta Get Out of This House, and the concept behind it was that Beetlejuice had been cursed to be trapped in this house since before it was a house, when it was a cave, like in prehistoric human times. And then in the opening number, we follow him all the way from prehistoric times through the kind of pioneer era of America, all the way to contemporary America. And then the, and then the Maitlands walk in, and um, no one wanted to do that. Uh, because it required cavemen, and it required pioneers, and it was... Um, it was probably David Corrins that killed that idea, let's face it. He's not there, I can put it on him. So, uh, uh, I'm really excited to do this song for you. It's called Gotta Get It Out of This House. I'm going to be um, Beetlejuice uh, for it. And these guys hiding in the corner because there's not quite enough space for all of them. They're going to be cavemen, they're going to be pioneers. Uh, and we're going to, I'll see you at the end of it. See how it goes. 